Hey you guys, how's it going? It's Prime Tom PC here. We're back with more Let's Play Lego Harry Potter years one through four. Alright, so we have part six in the last part we uh finished up the Quidditch level and we got an achievement and uh watched the epic cutscene at the end. But uh anyways guys, how are you guys doing today? It is the nineteenth today, and uh yeah. Alright, so let's continue on here. Um so well, the past couple days, um I've been doing this thing uh, for NHL making money, and uh, I've made enough money, I'll, I'll make enough money by Friday to, uh, because I actually, like, made enough money, I just gotta get the money, pretty much, so I'll have, like, 300 bucks on Friday, and I've been seriously deciding, uh, I've been contemplating whether I want to buy an HD PVR to record my games on, and I'm still kind of deciding, I just want to hear your guys' thoughts on it, if I should spend the 250 bucks on it. Like, do you guys think it's worth it? Anyways, I'll just continue off that crap after this cutscene. Alright, so, what I was talking about, yeah, it would be a Hapagu HD PVR, and everything would be recorded in HD, uh, except for my, um regular stat like my GameCube games and stuff, that would still be on my Dazzle. But everything on the Xbox and stuff would be high HD, so just let me know let me know in the comments what you guys think if I if you think the two hundred and fifty bucks is worth it. I, I don't know, I'm still kinda torn, I'm not really sure because there's other things I need to save up for and shit, so I don't know. Let me go let post on the comment box what do you guys think. So anyways let's watch this. Alright, so, moving on to the restriction section, um, for some reason, I've noticed uh, a lot of people don't like this part, they think it's hard. Honestly, I don't really get why, I think this is one of the easiest parts of the game. Uh, I don't know if that's just me, but, you know. But, uh, anyways, so that's Harry's own special little abilities, you can use the invisibility cloak. Now, first thing you want to do, you'll see these red little books going around, you want to take these out. So, go in the invisibility cloak, and then go over them and press Y. Trust me, you want to do this. Such a pain in the ass if you don't do. Trust me. Trust me. Like, Alright, so first things first. Um, hang on, dude. Dude! Hold on, go back over there, dude. What are you doing? Alright, so the cauldron will pop up there. So we use Wingardium Leviosa. Once I get to that. Come on, dude. Stop failing. There we go. Alright, so we're going to be making another exploding potion. So Ron should help you up there. Hop on up there. There's, uh, I can't remember if there's two or one you can draw up here. I think there's only the one. Which is this flower right here. Yep. Oh, there's, the, yeah, that's right, the spider's up there too. Alright, so let's quickly plop this one down first. There we go. Alright, let's get Ron to lift us back up. Ron, you're a good person. Lift us up, thank you. Alright, let's grab this red spider. Freaking collecting red spiders and stuff. Man, that'd be crazy, man. But crazy! But... Down, down, down there. Alright, so what you have to do here is, uh, yeah, hit that with the spell and then I'll build this. Which is a little book for the little wizard here. Then he's gonna knock down a bunch of books, so we're gonna jump up there, jump up there. Then you can double bounce up there. Yeah. Then we use Wingardium Leviosa and then melt all that. I guess it's supposed to be ice. But, I, yeah, I just hit that just to see what would happen. It's just kind of like, yeah. I still really don't know what that mosquito thing kind of thing just did. I'm not really sure, to be completely honest. Maybe I'll go check that out later. If any of you guys know, yet again, this is the second thing I'm asking you guys to put in the comment box, but if you guys do it, you guys will be awesome. All right, so let's blow up that. Let's walk in here. Let's see what we got. Wow, Dumbledore. Okay, for some reason, people always get caught here. I don't get it. Like, I can wa pretty much walk right beside Filch and he doesn't catch me. 
Like, I don't know if that's just my personal experience, or is it just because I'm awesome? I, I don't know, but I guess anything is possible. Alright, so we're going to grab this little... Isn't that green? Yeah, and then we're going to put it in this little puzzle pe little puzzle we got going on here. Oh, come on. It's not failing. There we go. Alright, blue. Boom. We'll open that up. Let me get the key to that door that Dumbledore just went through. Yeah. Alright. Slowly make a... See, look at this. Filch is... Oh, God! He was right there. And it's just like he doesn't even see you. <laughs> Alright, let's get in that hole. Okay, so... We're gonna need Ron here. And we're gonna knock down this bookcase and get Scabbers going. Need Ron's help for something. Like, damn. Can't be completely useless. I don't know how the hell Sab Scabbers can, like, run on its side on walls and stuff. Like, damn. Alright, so let's gonna open up that door. Now I got a pretty damn important cutscene coming up. Alright, so what you're gonna do is use Lumos right here. Then these two bats are gonna fly above this magic mirror! Oh my god, I'm never doing that again. Or the magic mirror! Oh my god, I really need to stop that. Alright, let's walk up and we got a cutscene. Oh my god! Sorry. Alright, level complete. Nice. Alright, let's continue on with the story. Holy crap, I can f go through those menus pretty damn quickly. Special talent? I don't know, maybe I'm just like sick of all the loading screen crap from Chamber of Secrets, even though that was like a really long time ago now. But trust me, dudes, I still hate the loading skins in that game. I always will. And it just, yeah. Alright, so I believe we're heading to class. I can't remember which class, but we are heading to class. I think. No, no we're not. Are we? I don't know. We'll find out. I can't remember for the life of me right now. Oh wait, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I know where we're going. Now, one thing was actually that I was kind of depressed about when I first played this. There's no, um... Norbert in this. I... It's kind of depressing because I love dragons. Personally, I have like dra I have a, like a dragon statue collection and stuff in my room. I I love dragons. I don't know if that's just me, but if you guys love dragons, then thumbs up to you. You guys are all awesome. But uh, all right, so we got the Hagrid over here. We're gonna hop into his cabin. This is what when I first played this game, I thought this was the Norbert cutscene, but it's not, which sucks. But uh, you guys will see what cutscene is in a second. Stupid cauldron, make me mad. Look at this. Boom! Just like freaking opens it, he just goes flying. Like, holy crap, if that isn't child abuse, I don't know what is. And how is he how like how would that not like break his spine? Especially with like all the force that just pushed him back in that rock, dude. That would like break your back, man. There's no way you could stand after that, man. Sorry, Malvoy. Queaver like a little biatch. Sorry guys. It was necessary, even though I love Malfoy. But I was pretty disappointed in him when I saw this cutscene. Alright guys, let's start the Forbidden Forest level. Um, Alright, there's a student in peril right there, obviously. It's like wide out, right out in the open. Um, this level actually gave me quite a bit of troubles when I first went through it for some reason. I'm not really sure why, but uh, it just did. Oh my god. Okay, these freaking bees in this level are so freaking annoying. It's unbelievable. Like, I don't, I don't know if, like, how people can like those stupid things. Like, ugh, I hate bees in real life, too. They piss me off, man. 
Especially when they're gonna like sting you and stuff. I haven't been stung in years, but oh, that's what that's the only thing I don't like about summer. All the bugs start coming out. But anyways, guys, this has been Prime Tunnel Peas. It's been a great video, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Later, guys.